Hey guys, Tech Manager with a video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you five different ways that you can recover your deleted photos or videos on your iPhone or iOS device. Now, these methods do not require you paying any third party software. It's simply a free method that you can use if you deleted a photo and would like to get it back and see if it's possible even to get it back. So let's get started. Here I have my iPhone, of course, here. The very first and the most simplest way to recover deleted photos is by opening up your photo album. Album. and you see here this is your main album right but if you go back here to your albums and go down here there's a folder called De recently deleted so if you click on that it will ask you to put your pass code or your face ID and you can see recently deleted photos now the way this works is if you deleted a photo in the past 30 days it will come here if you didn't permanently delete it from here so you can actually click on select here the photos that you like to recover and you click on recover and then recover photos and these photos will be recovered back to your main album now this is the simplest way to recover your deleted photos if it's been 30 days or less now let's it's been uh, more than 30 days or you deleted that recently deleted photo completely and it's not there the next method that we have here to recover your photos is by using your computer here so this time the computer we want to go to the Apple's iCloud website so what you'll do is go in your computer and then you're gonna go ahead and open up here I have my Safari browser open but any browser that you have so you're gonna go ahead and open it up and then all you'll do is go to iCloud.com right you go to iCloud.com and you're gonna sign in to your iCloud account the same one that you're using on your iPhone or Apple device that you're trying to recover photos from so all you do is go ahead and sign in so once you're signed in you're probably gonna get like a code if you have two-factor on or a trusted browser you can just click on trust here just so you can log in and once you're logged in, what you'll do is you'll see your interface here for iCloud here, a bunch of stuff going on. And the one thing we want to look at is the photos section here. As you can see, if I click on the photo section, I get my iCloud photos that have been saved so far here. And all I do is you can also see recently deleted here and the photos here. So the syncing between your phone and the iCloud hasn't happened yet. You might see your photos here and you can actually recover it or save it onto your computer. So you can click on any photo you like, right? You can click on here, this icon to download it right to your phone or you can share it somewhere and you can pretty much go through the photos that you have. Now, the other method we have after you have done that here, if you can't find it here, you wanna make sure that on your settings here, right? You go into your settings and then click on your Apple ID here. And once you do that, you're gonna wanna click on iCloud here. Once you click on iCloud, you wanna make sure on using apps using iCloud, we'll click on photos here, and then we'll do this option where it says sync this iPhone. You wanna click on syncing, turning on, and you wanna keep everything the same. So you wanna make sure that if you have photos in your iCloud, it will also sync and photos that are deleted between the devices will be available for you to have as well. So that's the other method to do it. Now, after you have done that and you still can't find it between your iCloud here and recently deleted, the next thing that you might have and most people do here is Google Photos. Google Photos is from Google's. A lot of times you might not notice, but Google Photos actually backs up your photos and videos if you're backing it up here so you might have a backup there as well so i recommend checking out if you have this again you might not have it but a lot of people have used google photos or even other uh photo saving apps like uh the picture storage ones that sometimes you, you might have used in the past those are also good places to look for deleted photos on your photos that you can go ahead and get as well now, after you have done that method and these method and you still can't find the deleted photos and videos, the next method we have, the method number five, it's going to be around restoring a backup off of for to your iPhone. So in order to do that, you need your iPhone. You need to connect uh, to your uh, MacBook or PC here. We're going to go ahead and plug in our cable here and then plug in the USB-C here onto our MacBook. If you have, again, PC that works as well. You need to go ahead and download on from Safari. You're gonna you download iTunes for that. So you go search for iTunes, which is apple.com slash iTunes. You'll get iTunes downloaded for Windows if you have Windows or Microsoft Store as well. You'll download iTunes. But 
on our MacBook, on the newer MacBook, you can actually use your Finder. So we're going to open up, open up Finder here on our newer MacBook. And all we'll do is click on the right here where it says iPhone. And then I click on iPhone here and it should load up the information about the iPhone here. And what I can do here is do a restore backup. So if you have a backup, let's say you did a backup maybe fairly recently with it, with the photos or videos that you deleted, you can actually recover them using that backup as well. So you'll click on restore from backup. It will allow you to choose a backup. So I recommend, of course, the most recent one. But remember, if you're doing a backup, it will restore to that point. So you might lose anything after that. So you want to make sure the photos, videos that you have, maybe back it up using your iCloud or Google Photos like that so that you have your newer photos and the ones that you want to get it from your backup as well. And that's, well, hopefully if you deleted the within that backup that you have, if you saved a backup on your computer, then you'll be able to recover those photos. So those are the methods of recovering your photos and videos. I don't recommend any third party paid apps out there. There's a bunch that there's looking to gonna get you to buy stuff. I don't know if they really work. I Never had luck with those. So if you follow these methods, hopefully you can get the photos and videos that you deleted. If not, unfortunately, there's not much you can really do. So hopefully at least this video is helpful. If so, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.